we have shown that cos 5 theta equals to cos theta times this thing in brackets here, 16 sine to the power 4 theta minus 12 sine squared theta plus 1. The question goes on to say, by considering cos 5 theta equals to 0, show that the exact value of sine squared pi over 10 equals to 3 minus square root 5 over 8. So, let's do it slowly. Let me write some things here first, just in case you're wondering where did they get pi over 10. So, if I have cos 5 theta equals to 0, 5 theta will be equals to, let me remind you, this is your basic cos wave. This is pi over 2, and this is pi, and this is 3 over 2 pi. So, if I write cos 5 theta equals to 0, 5 theta we can start with pi over 2, we have 3 over 2 pi, and so on. I hope you see where pi over 10 is coming from. So, theta will be pi over 10, and then we have 3 over 10 pi, and so on. Okay, they're not keen on those values. Okay, we're just taking the smallest value. Okay, 5 theta equals to pi over 2. So theta, you divide by 5, you'll get pi over 10. So you're basically on the right track. You know where this pi over 10 is coming from. Okay, let's leave that there. Let me erase this. Okay, if you set this equals to 0, okay, if you set this equal to 0, we can write 16 sine to the power 4 theta minus 12 sine squared theta plus 1 equals to 0. Okay? Now, basically, we need to solve this equation. So, what we can do is, okay, we, what we can do is, we can say let u be equals to, is everyone with me? We are trying to solve this equation. Um, let's use substitution, okay? It will probably be easier for you. Let u be equals to sine squared theta. So we can write 16 u squared minus 12 u plus 1 equals to 0. Okay? The signs are about 4, therefore you must have u squared. Okay? So again, I'm using substitution u equals to sine squared theta. Now this one looks easier to handle because this one is a quadratic in u. Okay? So let's write u will be equals to slowly what have I done? minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a so here I'm using the quadratic formula so we need to clean this up okay so let's do that 12 plus or minus this is 144 minus uh, 64 let's do that here use your calculator okay 80 over 32 so what is the square root of 80 you search 16 times 5 ah things are looking good so I have 4 root 5. Now I'm going to continue here. Okay? So I have 12 plus or minus 4 square root 5 divided by 32. And if you divide by 4, you will get 3 plus or minus square root of 5 over 8. So, like we said, 5 over 10 is the smallest angle. Then we have 3 over, 3 over 10 pi and so on. So we'll take the smaller value. So we can write, remember, let me, let me not rush through this. This one here is, is u. What is u? It is sine squared theta. So now, like I said, the smallest value here is pi over 10. So we can write sine squared pi over 10. Let me erase it. Too close. Will be close to 3 minus and we are done okay uh, don't worry about the plus because that's for values that are bigger than pi over 10
So the smallest value value will be 3 minus square root 5 over 8, like the question has asked you to show. And we're done.